is a beautiful day outside, so let's go spend it inside. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Hi, hello, how are you? How has your week been? I don't normally start videos like this in my car, but today we're going to be doing something super fun. I have decided that I want to go to every bookstore in Waco, which there's only four of them. So like, it's not gonna be like that hard. There is Brazos Books, Barnes and Noble, a half price book outlet, and a bookstore, bookstore coffee shop crossover called Fabled. So let's get going. But first we have to go pick something up. Hey buddy. How are you? How was the game? It was good. It's you need to stand the whole time though. Really? Yeah. I thought, oh my God. <laughs> hey boy. Hey. Oh we are bringing a friend. Oh, this is Kate. Hello. <laughs> We're gonna go to Brazos Books first because it one's furthest away and it closes at six. There? No. Oh. But Courtney's boyfriend was telling me about it last night. He said it was really good. So yeah, that's where we're headed first. She's a little scary looking. <laughs> mm. Reached by red matched. I didn't like it. <laughs> oh, this. I hated it. It was so bad. Well, because it's not actually written by JK Rowling. Really? Yeah. Oh, it says base on. Yeah. No, it's awful. This one? was pretty good. Yeah, I love it. Oh, you read it? Oh. I recommend it. Oh, did you? Yeah. yeah. Well, I read it. I got this one. I liked it. Oh. I must have forgotten that you recommended that. <laughs> this is the type of dishes my we used to have at my house. Really? Yes, that, like, the pattern. That's so funny. That's funny. <gasps> Look at the little oh, squishies. The fox did. <laughs> Pocket stress pets. <laughs> Little paper balls. Oh, that looks like that that book series I used to read. Oh, the rainbow oh, fairy I, one. Yeah. First stop, Brazos, Brazos books. books. <laughs> and we're done. We weren't in there for very long. It was cool. It was cute. It was cool. They had a lot of handmade things. Yeah. And it was decorated really nice. It was. I was saying most of their books were from like the checkout <laughs> aisle of a grocery store. Okay, wait, where are we? Oh. Back up. <laughs> okay. I will. Um, what would you rate them? Um, out of what? Out of five stars. Um, keeping on. I rate them. Um, like a three stars. For okay. like aesthetic. I agree. It was cool. Yeah. I liked the like, I was saying, <laughs> I liked the close proximity of the bookcases. I thought it was a nice little vibe, but I didn't like it when I was trying to move, pa scooch on past a man. <laughs> or when that guy was asleep on the couch. Yeah. <laughs> that was a bit weird. I didn't like that either. Okay. Um, I don't know where okay. I am. <laughs> Next up is Half Price. Half Price Book Outlet. Outlet. We'll see if we can find anything in there. I'm hopeful. Me I'm too, looking. I feel like I am too. Bookstore number two. Um, well clearly they couldn't get these to sell. Kind of lost in here. I wanted to see if they had any Sarah J Maas, but honestly they probably won't. Oh, and look at all these books. Wait, what is this? Why does it have a Disney symbol on it? Is it a Little Mermaid retelling? I'm confused. Look, it's got this Disney sign on it. Me to a tree house. I mean, I was just looking, glancing through, you know? What's this in here? Is this just like regular fiction or, oh, that's poetry. Not what I wanted. Or is this like, I can't tell. I'm a little confused. 
Ooh, fun. I guess the, oh yeah, they're cozy mysteries. That makes sense, but this, the covers are misleading. It was a bust. Again! Uh, we found nothing worth buying. It also looked like the checkout aisle of a grocery store. Ugh, and I'm so sad because my roommate just went to a big half price books in Dallas and she found good stuff. But we know Barnes & Noble will have some good stuff. They're just gonna be a little bit more pricey. It's okay. We saved money not buying things here. Girl map! So <laughs> now we get to spend more of Woohoo! Okay, now I can figure out how to get to Barnes & Noble without the GPS. Now here, we're gonna find something. <laughs> Probably too many somethings. Make our wallets cry. Uh, it's okay though. We will be happy, but our wallets will not. But book. What book? The Dolly Alderton one? No. I haven't read any of her stuff. I read this one. I really liked it. It's a little spicy, but that's okay. I read that. Is incredibly oh, spicy. <gasps> Wait, don't say that. Now I'm I have sorry. to buy them all. Oh gosh. I've heard that. Wait. <gasps> no, it's they're all like literally all of these books. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> have you heard of this one? Yeah. Emma just bought that one. I get it. Do it. Oh <gasps> Maybe I don't like that much. <laughs> okay. Oh, no, none of them. None of these. Oh, these ones don't. Someone just did this. Oh, well, that's rude. These ones do, though. I'm too poor to have book buying be a hobby. I said we're we're too poor for book buying to be a hobby at this point. Oh shoot, that's embarrassing. I just know. <laughs> we blind date with a book. <gasps> I don't, I'm not trusting enough of They're all kind of small books. <laughs> I just want to buy this whole table. But alas, I cannot. We're too poor for this. I was <laughs> <laughs> standing in barns. And googling where to buy other paper books. <sighs> These two start to have our price range. It's and not that I got my price range, it's that I can save money getting it online. So I well, and currently we, we don't have money. <laughs> so saving money, okay, maybe you do. So. Okay, <laughs> we did buy some books. We bought one thing. We were, well, no, I bought two. Oh. Two things. I was only gonna buy one, but then I was like, if I buy um, one, one fresh baked cookie, gets fifty percent off the second cookie. Oh, uh, the Hawthorne Legacy, and I said, well, if I've got the Inheritance Games and the Hawthorne Legacy, I you can't leave the Final Gambit there by itself. Agreed. Agreed. So now I have both. And they were all not, three. And both of those were the same price as like one book. One of the other ones we were looking at. Yes. Because I want to read What's Upon a Broken Heart series, and I have to read this first. Yeah, and see, a lot of people didn't really like Carvel all that much, but I, I know. loved it. So I have, I have I to say, I did like the other two better than that one. In this series? Yes. Okay. That one was a 4.25, but I liked the other ones better. But that one was not bad. Well, so I not was to say gonna, I did not like that one. I was going to borrow because I did like Jess's that one. book. No, I don't have to. Well, you're still going to borrow the other ones. <laughs> No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna I, let's be honest, I'm gonna buy the other ones. The Barnes and Noble was a success. Was well, a success. and we've decided we are going to forego we could still going go, to Fables. Okay. <laughs> well, we're just gonna want to buy them and not That's be able true. to. That is true. We're going to bookshop. We're gonna go online. online. That's all. Do you wanna go somewhere for dinner? Or like, I'm up for what? You know what sounds kind of good? What? Lion Rose. I've never had Lion Rose. Let's go. <gasps> you never had No, but I want to. But I just don't know okay. what to get. If you have any rat work on I always get the mm, Honolulu chicken. Okay. Let's go. 
Okay.